How are you? I'm Varek. Nice to meet you. There you go. Varek, you can hold this. Thank you. So, Varek, we, we are perplexed. We see, we see plywood, yeah. we see apples. You see a lot of stone as well. We see some stones. And we see this. What is this? So, this is LAPCA. LAPCA is the personal environmental monitor. It's actually uh, four sensors, four separate devices which measure in your personal space. Uh -huh. So, you can measure different things around you and know about them and play with them uh -huh. and learn about them. So, uh, this one is radiation. So, there's actual Geiger tube inside it. This one is, uh, uh, it's later. Okay. This one is EMF and uh, it's measuring electromagnetic fields, mm. like low frequency and high frequency. Right. So, okay. uh, which is rare because usually they go separately. Right. Um, this one, the small one, it's the cutest one. It's, uh, it is the cutest yeah, one. Yeah, it's like far. a baby. It's like a baby, all, all, all of them. <laughs> yeah, and it's uh, humidity and temperature. I see. And this one is the most interesting one because it's measuring the uh, whether your food is organic or not. Whether your food is organic? Yeah. How, how does that work? Well, this is really, it's not really, it's, it's almost simple. Uh, we're measuring the amount of nitrates inside the raw apples, uh -huh. raw fruits and vegetables. Uh -huh. And by this information, you can tell if it's organic or not. It's really? that easy. Yeah. I mean, because, it sounds simple in theory, Yeah, because, but... uh, because uh, nitrates are actually fertilizers, mm -hmm. and it's, re it's re easy to detect. So that's it. And they all mm -hmm. come uh, in a set of four sensors, and you can carry them around. And the app also is really interesting because... Uh, oh, the app? Yeah, can, we, can we take a look at the app? It's there. It's inside, oh, the app, see, yeah, inside the app, there is no numbers. Okay. I mean, there are some numbers, but numbers not make it, you know feel better it's uh -huh. no, not making any sense so we kind of uh, show you information in uh, different uh, types like beautiful visualization mm -hmm. or just chat interface it's explain you like in human language uh -huh. why it's bad why it's good and also there's achievements to unlock so it's the tool that engages you to use it every day mm -hmm. and uh, it's become more like a fashionable acce accessory that and conversation starter so just start to talk about it. I mean, it's very, very cool. Much Thank more you. so than I expected kind of walking over here. Thanks uh, a lot. I'm curious as to who you think the target market for a, a product like this is. Who do you want to go out yeah, and buy well, something the, like this? There's two answers. The first one is that people who are just aware. Okay. And our point is that all these devices actually exist somewhere else. Mm -hmm. They're just ugly. <laughs> they're ugly this and they, this is they're ugly. Right uh, the black boxes with arrow, uh -huh. and uh, you thought that they will be boring. So we just we thought that this is actually really cool tools, and we should uh, redesign them and rebuild them. Mm. And uh, I think that everyone can use it because it's uh, just fun to know and see the thing that you can see. Uh, however, more specific answer is just uh, health enthusiasts, uh, like fitness. You can track. Uh, your space for yoga, sure. for gym, uh, if you're a young mom, you can uh, mm -hmm. track and uh, check your space for uh, newborn uh, babies. And of course, the countries where the quality is not, the quality of life and food and environment mm -hmm. not that great, like right. uh, Russia, India, China, there's uh, issues with food, so we can use it as a professional tool to detect the things. If we're, if we're considering using them as a professional tool, I guess this question is worth asking. How sensitive is something like, like the Geiger sensor and the uh, EMF Well, uh, they, it's uh, to make them that beautiful uh -huh. and cute. Very cute. And small. I think you've succeeded at yeah, that. We, 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 of course, have some compromises, but they're not big. So, for example, uh, reactivity, you can compare it with actual professional military Geiger counter. Uh -huh. There's only one uh, difference. It measures, uh, it takes a little bit longer. Okay. So it's not immediate, it's just two minutes uh, more. That's okay. it. Uh, I, I, say, I wager to say that's not too yeah. bad. It's not the bad, of course, it's not the bad. <laughs> you, you, you have beautiful things, they don't have this uh, yellow box. Right. Uh, yeah, same with humidity and other things. There's just uh, small compromises in time or in process of measurement. Because, for example, for organic, you have to wear white uh, suit and it be in lab to measure actual nitrates. But we can make it. Uh, fun and easy. Great. That's very cool. Uh, Vadik, is this available now? Can people go out and buy this? Yeah, it's available right now. And, and where can they get them? It's on our website. And it's, uh, yeah, it's online. Great. Vadik, thank you so much. This is really thank very cool. Thank you very much. Cool. Thank you.